McGregor well in control. Alvarez getting loose, getting better here in this round, though. Oh, man. Until that. Oh, he's done. He's wow. done. History has been made. Conor McGregor is the UFC lightweight champion. What a performance. Did it flawlessly. Look at this counter. Boom, over the top, on the jaw. Right hand. And a big one to the temple. Right hand behind it. And Alvarez goes down, and he's essentially done there. I mean, Eddie Alvarez can take a tremendous punch, but Connor's accuracy and power was just too much for him. He didn't come here to take part. He came here to take over. Nice slip and a little counter. You can see how comfortable on the feet McGregor it's is. It's unbelievable. Look at the angles. He circles. He can fight going forwards. He can fight going backwards. I Look at that, that uppercut. uppercut. Now, Mark Over is the top, top, looking to finish it here. Conor McGregor, another first round win. Wow, ultra impressive UFC debut. Look at the uppercuts, it all started with the uppercuts. That's what really dazed Marcus Brimage. And from there, it was all Conor McGregor. There's that killer instinct and accuracy. Again, the uppercut early was the one that did damage and uppercuts here lead to the end of the night of Marcus Brimage. Outstanding UFC debut for Conor McGregor. And it's a nice posture for striking for Conor McGregor, really throwing the legs to the side, landing a nice big shot. Trying to hurt Janssen with some shots, and I think he's He's having some success with those shots. Yeah, Janssen forced to scramble forward, but he's left himself open for a pretty nasty cross face from Conor McGregor. Loads of time, Conor. Loads of time. told that he's got lots of time. And he's picking his shots wisely. Janssen just covering at the moment. Oh, love, lovely left knee to the rib. He's sitting in that sideways position, but now just pinning the head and landing big strikes from Conor McGregor. Janssen's going to have to do something here. And that's it, Neil Hall has pulled a halt to this. Jensen is not intelligently defending himself, and Conor McGregor wins by ground and pound and asks for a reaction from the crowd, which he gets. Yeah, good display from the Irish men, a slightly more measured approach than usual, but getting the job done once again with some vicious hands. Absolutely, still putting to use that excellent power that he has in both his left and his right, the Southpaw fighter. McGregor always kind of just in range, but far enough away from danger as he starts teeing off. Grandal looks Grandel. hurt. Grandal looks hurt. This could be the end. Big left. This could be an early stoppage. An early first comes round in. for McGregor. This could be it. That is it. It is wow. all over. And Conor McGregor is victorious. The crowd go absolutely wild. Wow. Here we see. A, few, oh, a beautiful long left hand, and then nice follow up on the floor, ground and pound. But for my money, the job was already done when Brandao hit the ground. It was game set and match for McGregor. A fantastic performance, a good body shot there. Possibly took some wind out of Brandao, and it was the straight left rear that sent him to the canvas. Very, very nice. Lovely handiwork there from Conor McGregor. Oh, he tagged him on yeah. the left, Mike. He heard and him. And up top. He hurt Poirier with that left. He's very good at utilizing all of his reach, turning that shoulder, fighting long. 90 seconds in. Right in front of him. He's talking to him now. Oh, yeah. Hands at his hips. Having oh, a conversation. Looking to finish the fight. That's it. Wow. That's the real deal, ladies and gentlemen. Make no mistake about it. Conor McGregor is for real, and he really did just make it look easy. He said he would make it look easy, he made it look easy. He said, first round KO, mark my words. All right, Conor, we believe you. It was an absolutely legitimate stoppage. I mean, that was just glorious. No one's ever done that to Poirier before. McGregor's the real deal, man, there's no doubt about it. O'Keefe perhaps worried a little in that opening exchange, but settling into his rhythm now. We saw against Dean Riley that he worked for a head and arm triangle from this position where he twisted it down to the mat. 
He looks to be going for that again. Yeah, it's good call, John, immediately trying to get that grip. You can see McGregor's going to have to be very careful not to let his frame fold. And Steve O'Keefe is squeezing for everything he's got. Oh, opting to drop low, though, immediately. Conor McGregor getting good underhooks in to defend. And again, the inside elbows coming in. Becoming very effective this evening. Oh, and wow, Mark Gard noticing Steve O'Keefe was... He was out. Unconscious from those strikes. The kind of power that guy can generate is scary for any featherweight in this division. And here's the end of the bout. Nearly 10 unanswered elbows, and that was... That was good night for Steve O'Keefe. Uppercut. McGregor. Chad can't stand Great in front of him like this. Mendez fires back. Looks for another takedown. Not this Connor time. stuffed it with 20 seconds to go. Big deep breath by Chad Mendez. Listen to this place. Oh, big shot by McGregor. Look at the clock closely. 10 seconds. Oh, he's hurt. Could he finish him here? Connor McGregor wow. is a UFC wow. interim featherweight champion. Wow. Chad had a very good round on top. But with seconds ticking away, Connor McGregor went to work. And he finished the fight. And he's the interim featherweight champion. The face of a fighting nation who said he did not come here to take part. He came here to take over. Herb Dean stops the fight. Again, looking for the rear naked choke. He's got good inside wrist control with that other hand. Looking to isolate and trap that arm. Dave Hill was wise to it. As we get set for a minute oh, left in this round. he's got the body round. triangle now, and look at the extension he's getting on his hips as he arches in to the back of Dave Hill. Dave Hill has never been submitted. It's a he's lot of never pressure. been stopped. There it is. Conor McGregor is victorious. A fantastic performance from Conor McGregor, who steals the title in a beautiful way, submitting Dave Hill to earn himself championship gold. Here we go! Green trunks for the Southpaw, the notorious Conor McGregor. Black trunks for the champion, Jose Aldo Jr. Conor relaxed and smiling. Oh, oh no! He slapped him! Conor McGregor oh. is the new UFC featherweight champion of the world! Oh, unbelievable! Oh my God! The first punch he threw, slapped him! It's a straight left. And Aldo connected with a left right afterwards as he was getting knocked out. And then hammer fist, out cold, boom. Doesn't get any cleaner than that, ladies and gentlemen.